All right. Uh, Clown Man's voice is a muse voice. <laughs> you know, let's see. Okay, seeing Clown Man's kind of stage setup, it kind of reminds me of um, Rodney and Billy Hatcher. What's the um, third to last level? I it's couldn't the tell you. I haven't played Billy Hatcher in five years. Uh, it, I think it was Circus Park. But that's what it kind of reminds me of, is the Circus Park game. Alright, uh, my wild choice is still Turtles in Time, but otherwise the cookie suggests... Echo the Dolphin, Defender of the Future for Dreamcast. Oh, that is better win. <laughs> Mega Man X7. Mega Man X7. <laughs> oh, no, that should win. Evil Zone for PlayStation 1. So we've got Evil Zone, Mega Man X7, Echo for Dreamcast, and Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. Oh, echo, 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 echo. Give him a sec, give him a sec. Echo, echo, Batman. Echo, 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 it's all echo. Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I had hope for you people, I had hope! <laughs> I had hope for you people! What have you done? <laughs> you heard the boy who put Echo the fucking dolphin in it! That's just the game he owns. Well, I guess we're gonna play Echo for Dreamcast. Oh my god. Uh <laughs> Jesus, alright. Give oh, give me a minute shit. to figure out where the hell all my Dreamcast cords are and then we'll be right back. While he's doing that, everybody, we'll take some questions. What do you got? Intermission. <laughs> unless he played, ban unless he played a, unless he played an ad. <laughs> I had hope. Proton John 2013. <laughs> 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 all right. Well, I know where my copy of Echo. Oh, actually, all my cords are connected to the Dreamcast. That's rare. John, are you back? Uh, yeah, I think we're back. Um, trying to hook up the Dreamcast killed my internet. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> Thanks, Obama. <laughs> but I'm Canadian! That doesn't even apply! <laughs> He's got a point. <laughs> but, um... What I, was, what I was saying as I got cut off is I got I found everything but my controllers, so now I gotta find my Dreamcast controllers. John, who's your favorite Power Ranger series? Who, who is my favorite series? Yeah, it's right. <laughs> English is not good for this chat. I'm going to assume what is your favorite Power Ranger series. Uh, I'm gonna say original, but I also really enjoyed uh, In Space. Okay, so... Space. Okay, I grew up with Power Rangers, and I think I quit at... Uh, Oh, I think I quit it after the third season, but I remember. Uh, I, but you know, here's the weird thing that though. Um, Linkara is doing this history of Power Rangers, mm -hmm. and I've been watching most of them. I've, I've actually finished off uh, the last one he did, which is I do believe. What's the last one? It wasn't. It wasn't SPD. I. Uh, Break, I can't. Emergency. Power Rangers are. Uh, Miss, that's it. So I remember. Oh, so. So okay. <coughs> so sorry. So, so after watching like all the Power Rangers, like you know, seeing the plots and everything and how they're act, uh, how it's done now. I'm gonna say wow, nostalgic trip, but at the same time, wow, it's really changed over the years. It yeah, went from it's like so over the top in the during the later seasons. It's ridiculous. Yeah, but they try well, to be, they try to be serious now. At least now, from, yeah. yeah, from what I've seen. I've, I, I've watched no. half an episode of that new series or whatever it was new at the time. The one that had um, that had Bulk come back. Oh god. I bulk and Scully as in Bulk and Scully Bulk? Yeah. Just just Bulk. Uh, bulk and his son or nephew. I don't remember what it is. Or no, it was Skull's yeah. son or something like that. I don't know. I oh, like yeah, I like I said I saw reason. one episode is cuz I was babysitting my sister's dogs. The dogs like Power Rangers? Uh, no, I like Power Rangers. The dogs <laughs> were just a casualty of my liking of Power Rangers. <laughs> but, you know, but, you know, it's interesting, though. Again, going back to, like, when I was a little kid, 
Power Rangers was a shit. It really was. And I, I can't remember how I got out of it. I think I just grew up and never watched it, or it, they that's, just... That's what it is for everyone. They just grew up and they just didn't have to worry about Power Rangers anymore. Well, it's just interesting that now it's still going after, like, so many years. I think it's, like, on 20 years now. That's not surprising. I mean, think about it. If if you become a kid, someone else will eventually become a kid. As in, they'll get born and fill that hole that we left. That's the, that's the beautiful thing about kid shows. They will always have an audience. Yeah, that's true when you really th when you think about it sociologically. Yeah. But it's just me, but again, it's just me because it's just amazing how, again, a show that I grew up with, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, and I think the last thing I actually saw was, well, the movie with Ivan News. Oh, wow. And then after that, and then after that, though. You missed out a lot if that's where you got out. Yeah, because it's, it's. You missed, like, Zeo and Turbo, Turbo space, in Space, Lost, Lost Galaxy, Galaxy Lightspeed uh, Red. That, that's, I think I just remember because it ju they just kept rerunning the shows. I can't remember, but this was, like, way back, like, in the 90s. Oh, shit. But, um, oh, shit. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay. I dropped my turtle van. Ooh. <laughs> the, uh, it's the, all the DVDs for the Ninja Turtles. Yep. Mm -mm. So they, they're placing, like, a weird turtle van. They barely stay in place, so. Oh, Wild Force. That was, that's the one I was thinking of. Lost Galaxy, Lightspeed Rescue, uh, Time Force. And, uh, I, I did and hear, I did hear though, I did hear that in like a really later series of when I watched it, um, Tommy actually came back and yeah, I was, was like, wow. He was like, he was, Dino Force, wow. yeah, he, was, like, he was like the Zordon of that series or something like that. But, but he actually fought, they like pretty much, they pretty much made it so that they retconned it so it was back to the dinosaur era. Because they ran out of ideas so it's like, fuck it, let's do dinosaurs again. But, it, but it was only... Three. Well, no. Technically, Tommy did came back. And Tommy. Was... Tommy became a ranger or something like that as well. If I remember. Yeah, he did. He became the Black Ranger. But Battle he. Was pretty but, good. But for but I remember though it, it, watching um, Lean Car saying for a long period of time they actually just had a stunt devil just be in the Black Ranger suit because he had to go away to go visit family. So. Well, Tommy. Yeah, pretty, like, Tommy was also was like an MMA in MMA fighting around that time too. So. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, there was actually yeah a... Tommy is an MMA fighter, like not maybe yeah. not in like UFC, but he's in like a bunch of leagues. Like, dude is a bruiser. Well, he's oh well, he was legitimately a martial artist. You could tell that immediately. And you're offline again. What? No, I'm not. No, I see the stream. Yeah, it, it just died for a second for me. Okay, it must be my internet. I'm running right. on wireless from my laptop so I can play Monster Hunter Online, which is crap. Echo the Dolphin, defender of the future. Done we haven't forgot about the fanfic, guys. It's just that. Oh, what? When which, Power which, Rangers... which fanfic am I supposed to read, by the way? I don't know. Just, we, the, we don't know in the chat right now. It's really short. Someone keeps on wanting to try a Chris one, which is. I don't know. Uh, the, I, I've got one that's called the Not Gay TG, TRG fanfic. I've got that one too. And then the one we posted in the chat is called The Story of Proton John Tet. So, so which. Okay, okay, that sounds great. Should, which one should I read? Before we load uh, up Echo. Just, uh, pick the tent one that right. one's already in the chat. Yeah, it's in the chat. Both of these are short, which is the main reason why I'm doing this, because it's only it's only like, going to take like five seconds. All right. Wait. But Waluigi voice. Oh, God, really? All right. Well, I, I can I, do I, it. I, <laughs> no, I'll do it. I'll do it. Hang on. <clears throat> As my cold starts kicking in again. The uh -oh. story of Proton John Tent. Once upon a time, there was a discount tent by the name of Proton John. Everybody bought the nice new tents, but no one would buy John. But one day, a young American of the name of Emil bought John the tent. John, you're an amazing tent! Why the <laughs> fuck are you talking to a tent?! Because I'm Chugga, what do you expect?! Ha <laughs> ha! The end. <laughs> oh my god. If Chugga was in this call, I bet you he would just have the best of times with these fanfics. This is the not gay TOG uh, fanfic, by the way. It's actually pretty funny. <laughs> I just decided to give him my Pee Wee Herman voice. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> Hell if I know why I chose that. If I knew, if I understood why I made choices, then 
I would be living a completely different life. <laughs> would you now? Probably. Why? I don't understand. That's why. Okay. Works for me. Following in the tracks of the truth. <laughs> <laughs> you what? Sleep in Proton the tent. <laughs> let's let's stop that where it's going. <laughs> I, literally writes itself. Uh, I don't. Pee wee is a meal equals mind blown. I uh, don't want to. Watch me not have enough space on any of my memory cards for this. Oh, nope, there we go. Yeah, they only come with like 120 or something low like that. I'll enter my initials like an arcade machine. Options. Language. We can play in Spanish. Hola, señor. ¿Cómo estás? Accelerate, charge, sonar, special. Left trigger, le look left. Right trigger, look right. <laughs> y plus right trigger, roll left. Y plus right trigger, roll right. Rise and call. Opinions on Dynasty Warriors. Fun, but not worth a full $60. I heard the new one is slightly different than usual. No, no I, didn't, I didn't try the new one. Oh, prologue. What are we going to learn about You can only play in Spanish. Spanish, if you know how to swear in Spanish, that is a really illogical, um, well, I'm trying to look for the word meaning, I guess. Chris, football redfield eats an egg. All right, I got to open this I one. think I've got that one. Let me click on it just in case. Uh, no, it's a different one. This oh. is a Google Doc. What the hell? Holy sh... Oh, no. This one, this one looks good. This is short. I think I'm going to read this one. Okay, go for it. Yep. Should I pay attention to the fact that we're in space right now for a dolphin game? <laughs> what? That's how the Echo games have always been. I know, I know. I remember. I just tried to block <laughs> out the boss of the first one in my mind. <laughs> oh, okay. Wait a minute. Okay, what in the world? A dolphin is the protective, but we're in space. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, play a de play play an echo game. They're surprisingly deep. Yeah, that's the funny thing. <laughs> okay, now I might actually have to read this. <laughs> but humans and dolphins brought their age of conquest to an end. <laughs> Driven to the brink of defeat, the foe plotted vengeance on Earth because of humans and dolphins. But the few caretaker dolphins who remained behind were not defenseless. Oh my god, this game's for real. Protected by their greatest creation, the Guardian shielded them with its immense power. Oh god. This is fucking great. Yeah. It's a Mecco game, what the fuck are you expecting? I don't know! <laughs> To be fair, the original Echo games didn't really tell you much in the story. It was about like how much you played, and it just kind of eventually told you along the way. Yeah, like it was, the yeah, it was heavily inferred along the way. Echo is the only hope for humans and dolphins. Even though you never see another human again. Yeah, Echo is the defender of Earth's future. Yay, space dolphins! Yeah, this is probably the only dolphin that's ever traveled through time. Mm. John. John, Rodney, have you any of you played Skullgirls? No, but I keep I meaning to. I love Skullgirls. I keep meaning to get it. I, I, I want to get it. it. So much fun. I heard um, their their Kickstarter um, ended really a long time ago, but they raised they, they a lot. They did really well. They got enough to make five new characters, a whole bunch of stuff. A uh, couple characters are even going to get new stories for the story mode. Greetings, Echo. You are... Oh, God, no. Oh boy, oh boy, it inverted too. Oh god, it feels like I'm playing fucking Star Fox or Crimson Skies. Okay, so Oh god, yes. I'm going to make someone I'm I'm gonna make someone definitely oh, motion god. sick while playing this. That's ridiculous. This uh, looks awesome. Oh my <laughs> I'm sorry god. if you get motion sick, guys. This is literally what this game is doing right now. Yeah. And now we swim upside down? No, it won't let me swim upside down. Guys, I have changed the game. 
I have changed the game on the update thing, so if it's not updating for you, then it's Twitch's side. Sorry. Echo for Smash Bros. If that dolphin makes it in Smash, people will have. If these. Sonic gets back in, Echo could make. Well, actually, I don't think they ever released. Did they ever release one for GameCube? No, I don't think so. And Echo, no. Yeah. It, Dreamcast was the last one, if memory serves me. Oh, it's not, yeah. Besides, like a re-release on uh, GBA. Oh well, GBA. There you go. Okay, for Wii Fit Girl, there's a difference. As much as people may not like Wii Fit Girl being in Smash, how you could have you not to... like her? Everyone loves it. Everyone loves I have an right. inventory. <laughs> <laughs> what? I have no. I have no songs or gifts or abilities. But apparently, I can. I have zero out of five vital lit. This dolphin what? has access to hammer space. Apparently, jeez. All right, I gotta dash through the fish to get food. I, I make a slurping noise whenever I eat fish. But how, anyway, could not, how could you like? How could you not like Wii Fit Girl being in Smash Bros? That inspired so much Rule Thirty Four. Well, uh, that that's your re requirement. No, it's not a requirement. It's just a perk. <laughs> well, okay, but here's the thing. And okay, I'm, I'm waiting. Yeah, me. so both of us are. Yeah, By all means, it's go it's ahead. Tell us why it's horrible. No, it's not horrible. No, it's not no, horrible. Are you, you, no, 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 no. It's not horrible. I'm just saying. You have to look at it this though. We fit sold a lot. It sold a lot of copies, the Wii Fit board, plus it got people to really start exercising. And what's interesting, though, is in one retirement home, I remember because my sister had to do a study, um, they actually brought a Wii Fit there, and along with along with like Wii Sports and anything that's really active, that um, facility got most of their um, elderly people active, at least maybe 85%. So... As much as you don't like it, guys, it's part of Nintendo's um, well-marketed games, even though technically people are saying, no, it's not a game, but it's sold a lot. So. I, haven't, I haven't heard a single person complain that Wii Fit Trend is in the thing. Where have you heard this, is what I want to know. What? I've heard people say it was silly, but I've never heard them complain. Yeah, me too. No, I've, I've heard people complain because they're like, oh, this is the kind of character they're going to put in the game. But most people I've talked to are like, yeah, that's a fucking hilarious addition. Thank God yeah. they did that. Yeah, that's what I'd say. What about that petition going around to get Reggie in there? Dude, <laughs> I'm, to I'm totally down for that, too. Add Reggie in the that'd game. I don't care. Amazing. That'd be amazing. <laughs> uh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. Um, What about Reggie getting in Smash? There's, There's a, a petition going around. I don't know if it's done yet or not, but they were getting signatures. I think they got like 40,000 people all signed it <laughs> to get Reggie Filzame, the president of Nintendo of America, in Smash Bros. 4. Yeah, to be a playable character oh. in Smash Bros. 4. Oh, and I'm... then Reggie put a personal tweet up on Twitter saying that his body would be ready. <laughs> 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 Alright, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay. I don't know if that's ever going to fly, but if it does, I will personally... That's, that's where I would start shaking my head, because that's just silly. I got no problem with the Fit Trainer being in there. But Reggie, Reggie's where you have the problem? <laughs> yes, that's where I start to draw the line. Just a little bit. But you can't really ruin it for me, because I got Mega Man. As long as I have Mega Man, I'm happy. I am so, so grateful. Finally, Mega Man's in Smash. After how many games now? Well, this is the fourth Smash Bros, so I would assume it's been three games. But I can't... Didn't... Wasn't there originally Mega Man supposed to be in the original Smash? No, it was supposed I to be Sonic. I think he was supposed to be put in Brawl, but deals uh, fell short at the last minute. Uh, I have to find a red fish. Didn't you just eat, like, a bunch of red fish? Yeah. Oh, are these sharks? I want to fight some sharks. You got echolocation. Ah, oh, there's an invisible wall in the water! I can't reach the <laughs> sharks! Of course! Punch the sharks! I want to punch some sharks as a dolphin. Well, I think you found the red fish, so I think Yeah, they're not that it. far away, all things considered. I appear to be eating them all, though. Yeah, I'm just slurping them. <laughs> Echo, shark puncher! Dude, you can't tell me that wouldn't be badass. Come on, shark. Um, dolphins. dolphins can dolphin punch sharks. I was about to say... If 
I can't remember. Call to your shark friend with echolocation. <laughs> I tried! That's literally what I just tried to do. <laughs> it didn't work, the invisible wall stopped Yellow me. Yellowfish. Yellow fish. I where are the where are those red I had a red fish in my mouth earlier, so I need to find that fish again. Uh, uh oh, whoa, whoa, something's going on. Zebra fish. Oh fuck zebra fish. The aliens are here. Oh uh, well there goes that shield. Now the invisible barriers are gone, now the sharks will attack. And there goes that entrance to your secret hidden loaded. God, I hope this means I somehow just lost the game because I couldn't find a red fish in time. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> if you did that... Okay, so quickly talk to somebody and figure out what the fuck just happened. Well, I can get if to Atlantis Superman now. I think that's what's implied. If Superman 64 and Aquaman Quest for Atlantis had a baby. Oh, God. Aquaman Quest for Atlantis. God damn that game. That better be next on your fortune could be. What, Aquaman? I don't own Aquaman. Yeah. Oh shit, I got stuck! <laughs> I am I am actually stuck right now! You're gonna starve under a rock. <laughs> <laughs> I Good literally- luck, I got Echo stuck! <laughs> it's just getting worse! Oh, it's just <laughs> getting worse! King <laughs> <laughs> of Superman 64. <laughs> <laughs> glitch counter one! Glitch counter one! <laughs> Katamari sound effect. Gee, John broke a video game? How did that happen? Yeah, it's a miracle. Yeah. It's a poor fish. He's gonna starve. I- I- th I'm slightly right. moving, it's almost working, but I- th I think I might actually be stuck. You're gonna clip through the ground. God, I oh, hope so. I hope so. I'm almost trying now at this point. Come on, Echo, you can do it. Get out of there. You can do it, Echo. Get out of that spot. <laughs> How did Echo, that Echo, Echo, Echo. This somehow became Let's Play Echo the Dolphin 2. Let's watch a dolphin drown. <laughs> oh god, I don't want to imagine that. But okay, let's find out. I'm loving these comments. I know, right? John, His body is ready. <laughs> 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 oh my well, I'm out of air, so now I'm just gonna be taking damage. Oh, you're hungry. <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound he's. It's anything like. <laughs> According to IGN, this was considered the best game of 2000. One up. One up. Oh, one up. Good, good to know. Good job, IGN. Good to know in 13 years we've come so far. There we go. And then Echo, no, no. Echo, you must continue on. It is your destiny. It is counting down. It is counting down. Because, you know, that's how continues work in platforming games. I know. Just like arcade games. Mm hmm And what happens when time runs out, I wonder. Let's find out. <laughs> the aliens take over the... <laughs> I would be... If they had the balls to put that in, I'd be impressed. They're loading something. Is this just the opening cutscene, or is this... What is this? What is this? Well, this is outer space. It's the Big Dipper. Fist of the North Star is about to happen, apparently. <laughs> is and is something going died. to happen? Is, is something going to happen? It's literally just focusing on this. They're blinking... Stars. I'm afraid to like touch the controller at all. Cause this this uh, it's this is a cutscene, but nothing's happening. Okay. okay. And in case people are wondering, I am pressing buttons. Nothing is happening. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh oh nope. There we go. They they blinked out of existence. Eventually, like holy shit, that years that took later. forever. Like, what the fuck? Oh, <laughs> that was like super anticlimactic. That sucked. 
You're not even trying to protect the Earth. You're trying to protect the Big Dipper. Yeah, that's what the the Big Dipper was the true enemy all along. Son of a bitch! Gosh. I was expecting the planet to blow up. I had gotten my hopes up, but no, that sucked. All right, uh, let's. What was the? All oh, right, I gotta read that Chris Redfield story first. Oh yeah. Uh, so let's load up the intermission music. Meanwhile. Do, 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 boo, do, boo, do. Okay, so let's read out. Let's read out the story, and then we'll go to the fortune cookie again. All right. <clears throat> All right. The story is called Chris Football Redfield Eats an Egg. Oh, at least that's the file name. Then the actual story name says Chris Football Redfield's Dilemma. Chris, what are you doing? Sheva exclaimed. She was circumventing attacks from Albert Wesker, who was currently in the middle of executing a plan that would doom the human race. Her partner, Chris, was strangely inactive, opting to do nothing but stand. Chris was peering down at a mysterious object in his hand. An egg. Chris was entranced by the normally commonplace food product he found in the hangar, contemplating whether or not he should initiate his signature performance in an inopportune moment like this. Now is not the time, Chris! Sheva yelled, frustrated by her partner's incompetence. I must, Sheva! Chris protested. Pro yeah, protested. Are you out of your mind? It's more important! Chris attested. Chris was ready for another glorious moment between him and an egg, and thusly assumed position for his signature performance. Chris held up the egg with his right hand, sheathing his weapon to emphasize his priorities and ev <laughs> evidently questionable life choices. <laughs> Su suddenly, down from the heavens, an omnipotent voice boomed in the hangar. Ladies and gentlemen, back by popular demand, Chris Redfield eating an egg. Taking the initiative and embracing the moment, Chris chomped the egg and swallowed it whole, refusing to question its state of domeness. <laughs> Claps and roars of applause rebounded off the hangar walls, celebrating the encore of their favorite egg consumer. Chris stood for a few moments longer, <laughs> reveling in his fans' display of amazement. These performances were the second greatest moments in his life, the first being his sensational touchdowns, and he was not willing to give them up. And that's how Wesker destroyed the world. And somebody's writing in the Google Docs yeah, right now. Written by Puppet Master 9. Okay. That was, that was fucking great. <laughs> that was beautiful. I, you know what? <laughs> Applause. I must. That was that was pretty good. All right, that was worth it. 